On today's tech tip, we're going to be talking about product videos. We're going to be highlighting the red Komodo. We happen to have the Stormtrooper edition of this camera. We're going to mimic the new intro to the Star Wars theme. We're going to use this Lego Stormtrooper helmet as a prop to introduce this camera. One of the main things you're looking for in any product video is to show the contour, show the different elements and highlight the different features, often through lighting and through your focus. Because we're shooting this against a black backdrop, typically we do a push in move, which would be awesome for most products. But because it's on the back black drop, we won't see that parallaxing. So we're using this more to just position the camera and speed up that workflow. We're also gonna be shooting at a higher f-stop so that most of our product is in focus. We're gonna do these first two shots, not move the camera, and then we'll cut between them in the edit. The next shot that we're gonna do in this sequence is actually two time lapses. So we have an overhead one right here, and then we've got one on the slider. We're focusing on a really narrow plane, so we don't want the slider going too crazy of a move where we're losing that focus. Generally speaking, you don't wanna have autofocus on your time lapses because it could switch to something that you don't want it to be on. We are using the shutter release cable to have Arc 2 control the camera. And so it will take care of all of the ins and outs of getting each frame for this time lapse. It's important that you add the shutter release cable before adding the ethernet cable because it, it sort of hooks around it. So just put that in first, then put in the ethernet cable, then set up your move. Set keyframe one, moving to keyframe two, and keyframe set. So we'll start the move and cut between the slider move and the top down to really highlight this portion of the product video.